Uh, what does this mean? Oh, wait, 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 what's it doing? What's it, what's it doing? Oh. Uh, what happens when we go nine, one, one? What? Is it, is it ringing? Hello? All right, let's, uh, let's try turning this thing on. Is that a, is that something? Is that something we can do? Come on. Oh, was it already on? Oh. Hey, that turns on. Hello, YouTube Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Disassembly 3D. Yes, folks, we are back once again in this game. Uh, we've been slowly working our way down the list of items that you guys want to see destroyed. I think at some point we're actually going to complete this. It's just going to take a little bit. But yeah, you guys have been enjoying this series. I've been asking you what items you want to see me take apart next. So we will flash another poll in the top right corner. Uh, if you don't see your item up there, maybe comment below. Let me know what you want to see taken apart. But today, we're going to start off with something big, and I have a feeling this might actually be kind of quick. Uh, we're going to be doing the plane first. Uh, that was the highest voted item on the last episode. So yeah, we're going to do that first, and then we'll move on to a couple other items. I think we might also try to tackle the computer today, because that was also something that I saw a lot of comments on. So, But anyways, if you're enjoying Disassembly 3D on the channel and want to see more of it, hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. Comment below with the new items you want to see, and let's jump right into this. Oh boy, okay, I have a feeling this is gonna be quick. So we've got the airplane, and yeah, the airplane is probably, what, 170? Actually, that's a that's not as many parts as I thought it was gonna be. Oh, uh, let's look at the inside real quick, and... Eh, uh, well, that's somewhat detailed. I mean, you can see the panels, uh, everything looks nice. Uh, let's go back here. Oh, oh, look at this. Do all these individual seats... Oh, wait, no, see, this comes out in sections. You would figure they would make it like where all the individual seats come out, but apparently not. Uh, let's see, what's the back end look like? Is this two levels? Okay, so you have this level here. You can go down. Okay, this looks like, oh yeah, there is two levels to this. Oh, that is ridiculous. And then there's a, is this the cargo bay? Okay, here's the cargo down here. Okay, so now to disassemble this one. Um, yeah, I guess we could say, hey, let's pull it apart, but we can actually control this. How does this work? Because the skybox or the the walls right there. Hold on, let's go ahead and. Uh oh. Um. Wait. What does this mean? What, what does this mean? Oh. Oh, this whole thing moves. Okay. What happens if I just let off? Oh, that is too cool. Okay. Uh, what does this mean? Oh, wait. 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 wait what's it doing? What's it? What's it doing? Oh. Oh, that was bad. That... <laughs> I feel slightly bad about that. Okay, so apparently you can go forward as much as you want, but as soon as you turn left or right, you do hit the wall. So, huh. We're still down to 14 parts. I feel like we should just reset that. Like, what's the point in actually ripping this thing apart? So, let's go ahead. Let's make it take off again. So, if I hit down, does it dive bomb? Uh, let's see. I'd like to get a little bit better camera angle. Here we go. Okay, so we are in the air. And... Hmm, okay, so... Okay, so it stays. No, it's losing altitude. Alright, dive bomb. No, that's not a dive bomb. Nope, oh, that's just a terrible landing. Oh, that was a crash landing. Oh. Okay, so we still haven't broken this thing apart. Okay, so let's go down here and see what the... Wow, this looks terrible. That's a lot of damage. Okay, so let's go ahead. How does this rip apart? Oh, so nose cone, top, side. It still sounds like stuff is blowing up back there. It's okay. Uh, there's that. The doors come off. Oh, everything comes off on this. Wow. Okay, this is pretty detailed. You know, I'm actually really. What the? What's what's going on? What? <laughs> Well, where's the where's the nose going? Why is it doing that? Okay, you know what? Let's uh, let's do the shake method here. <laughs> oh, I feel bad about this. You just just break it apart. That's all you got to do. I mean, this is a this is pretty simple. But the bad thing is, I feel like I'm missing quite a few parts here. Which obviously, oh, is that first class? Well, that was first class. Let's go ahead and chunk that to the side here. Okay, all of those come out. 
Hmm, this doesn't feel like a very effective way to do this. It really doesn't. I feel like I should slam it up against the wall again and then go through and take up or take off the rest of the pieces. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, we are once again in the air, so let's go ahead and raise altitude and turn. There we go. Uh oh. 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 Yes. Yes. <laughs> Okay, see, now we only have four parts to work with. Now, the question is, is this like a, a needle in the haystack here? <laughs> Where, which, which four parts is it? Oh, no. I don't know if this was wise. Maybe this was stupid. <laughs> this probably wasn't a good idea. You know, I feel like the shake method would work in here. So if we were to take a, a part and then just shake it through the debris, something is bound to loosen up here, I, I think. Hmm, what could be sticking together? What's the landing gear? Oh, that's the landing gear. Is that one whole piece? I think it is. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's gonna be a lot of searching that's gonna need to go on here. See, it even blew off the doors, so I don't... Oh, is that a piece? Is that, is that something? No? No? Maybe? No? What's this? Nope, that's nothing. Okay, we're down to three parts. So the shake method is working. Let's grab a big chunk like a wing. And let's just, actually this looks like a little bit bigger chunk. Drag it through here. Come on. Let's do the sweeping. We're sweeping up. We're gonna find, <laughs> we're gonna find the one piece that we're missing here. Oh boy. Now come on. Come on. It is around here somewhere. Hmm. Uh, question is, where? Oh, oh, we just knocked apart. Okay, we just knocked something apart. We're down to one part. Now, I'm trying to actually figure out what is the more effective way. I still think it is crashing it, opposed to trying to rip this all apart uh, manually. But you have to get lucky as far as it actually taking the whole plane apart. Because I imagine some crashes actually completely explode the plane. Uh, let's see. Let's drag through there. Come on. There is one part that is going to sit here and hound me, isn't there? Hmm, the question is, I, I wish I knew what I actually just took apart. What's this? Oh, that's more, uh, that's first class. Okay, so... Oh, boy. I cannot believe I'm down to one part and I cannot find <laughs> where it is. I'm almost tempted to crash it again. I really am. Um, hmm. What could it be? There's so many parts on the ground. This thing... Oh, it's in a million pieces. What piece am I missing? I have a feeling, like, I want to say maybe it's a door or something. But I can't be sure until I actually spot the door. And I don't feel like sorting all these pieces out. It feels like this is kind of a lost cause at the moment. Okay, you know what? That is not working. I am down to one part, and I cannot find it. Uh, I've swept through this thing multiple times. It's, it's somewhere. It's a piece that's going to taunt me. You know what? I feel like we need to stick this thing back into air. All right, so we are ready to bounce this off the wall once again. Let's hope that this time we get a little bit more lucky. Oh, whoa. Uh-oh. Two parts. Are you kidding me? That was a good bounce. That was extremely good. But there's two parts left. No. <laughs> no, that can't be a thing. Why is there two parts left? Which two parts could it possibly be? Oh, no. Okay, uh, let's, uh, let's comb the area. I have a feeling this might be a little bit easier to do. It could be two things that are attached to each other. So if we hit the right part, we might win the level. I still hear stuff crashing too. Um, let's grab something big here, like this chunk of wing. And let's just run it through this pile and see if we can locate what is attached to what here. Knowingly, it's some... Oh, there's one. Okay, come on. We can do this. This might be a really good time without the bomb. What the heck? Is that really a part two? Oh, that's bad if that is. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this chunk here. Run it through. No, there's got to be a part here somewhere. There's got to be a part. <laughs> no, this is ridiculous. Oh, where is it? It's probably a door or something. It's probably something really stupid. Hmm. I think I'm left with one option. I'm going to have to manually start to go through parts here. And I'm going to have to figure out which part is still attached to the other part. Which this is going to be a little bit of a pain. But I do want to beat this level. So this is going to be worth it. I only have like 170 something objects to grab. 
you know, I'm still, now I'm kind of wondering to myself, would it have been quicker to just disassemble it on the ground? Uh, it wouldn't have been as satisfying to watch, I know that. But, we'll find this part eventually. Hmm, I feel like I've been through, <gasps> wait, no, is it this, <gasps> is this the part? Was that, wait, that wasn't it? That was still, that was a part! That was still attached! Oh, this has got to be a door somewhere. This has got to be a door. That door was still attached. I don't know how that didn't count as being the last part. Dang it. Okay, uh, let's do another sweep here. I'm almost through searching this pile. We are going to find this final part, uh, even if it kills us, which, you know, depending on how long we're here, this might actually do that. Wait, there's another piece. I think we've glitched the game. Because that was another piece that just... Oh, wait, how was, how was that the piece? Okay, so we snipped off a little piece. It didn't count, and then finally it counted later. I'm going to call shenanigans on that. But anyways, we did unlock the bomb. It took us 13 minutes. Realistically, I would have liked to have gotten that done in about 5 minutes, but I think we can do that with the bomb. Let's go ahead and try this out. Let's reset the plane. Now, question is, can you have a mid-air collision? I guess we should go ahead and first try out... Just dropping it and going, actually, let's get this in a better position. So if we were wanting to take this whole thing out and possibly get it down to zero, wouldn't we want to do something like, eh, set it right there. Okay, here we go. We've got the explosion ready to happen on the plane and, whoa, oh, that is awesome. Okay, 21 parts. Oh, look, the front. How's the front staying up? Oh, wow. All the seats. Okay, let's speed this up real quick. And let's go. Yoink. Huh. We're still down to 21 parts. And I think most of it is actually up in the front. It's amazing that the front didn't actually move. And Oh, that is just a pile of rubble. Okay, so question is, can you do this while it's in air? That would be something. I mean, obviously the most effective method has been running it straight into the uh, the side or the wall, and it does this weird bounce every time. But uh, maybe in air this thing does something? Let's go ahead and get it up. Here we go. How does this work? So if I were to drop this, where does it... Oh! Oh, it drops it way... No, that is really ineffective for me. Hold on. I can't use that back there. Let's try that again. Okay, so we're going to try to explode this mid-air, so, uh oh here we go. Alright, mid-air explosion. Oh, that is too cool. Okay, this might actually do it. There's a lot of pieces that are about to hit the ground here. Okay, here we go. Speed it up. Oh, oh, oh. Two, one. Are you kidding me? It's down to one piece again. That is unbelievable. This thing is, there's something on here that's really resilient, and I would laugh if it was the same piece, but I don't feel like going through the rubble and finding that one little piece that ended the last round. But anyways, I think it is time to go ahead and move on to the next item. Alright, so we're going to do a quick one here, and then we'll move on. I think we're going to, we might be doing that PC next. So let's go to, uh, do this phone real quick. This ought to be quick. Oh yeah, 20 parts. I totally got this. And this looks like an old Nokia phone. These things are like tanks. All right, let's see. Uh, can we turn this thing on? How do you turn on a phone like this? <laughs> it's been like 10 years since I've seen a phone like this. Uh, let's see. Oh, well, I'm pretty sure that's not how you turn these phones on, but, you know, that's a thing. Uh, can I take the glass out of the indestructible phone? No. Okay, so. Oh, we can dial. Hold on. Hold on. I'll clear that. Clear? Okay. What happens when we go 911? What? Is it is it ringing? Hello? Hello? Hi. 9111. Which button do I hit? I hit the Should be the call button, right? Like this one? No, oh, why why would you let me dial? Let me dial. Ah, you know what? You know what? Yep. Yeah. Eh. 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 How do you get buttons out of these? Okay, this is a this is like a little, uh, little fortress here. All right, let's go. Okay, that removes. And I'm pretty sure those little buttons, they have to remove. Uh, let's go. No? Maybe that just removes... That's a thing. You can select them. Okay, maybe those don't remove. All right, so let's go, um... Uh, let's unscrew the screen real quick. 
Uh, is that uh, got a screw here? Kind of curious what's on the inside of the phone. Should be like a SIM card and all that other good stuff. This is, a, this is definitely a quick one here. Let's go boom, boom, boom. All right, so that's unplugged. Uh, let's go ahead and flip this over here. So here's the board. Does this board separate? Oh, yep, it does. Okay, so that's uh, that's that. All right, so here comes the this panel here. All right, so let's get down to the nitty gritty. Let's say that comes out, whatever that is. That looks like maybe the headset or the speaker. This pops out, whatever that is. Uh, maybe that was charging. Okay, there's that, that, that. All right. Hmm. How does this? How does this come off? Uh, those more? No, those aren't screws that we can take off now. Okay, that doesn't come out. Hmm. This is kind of odd. Let's look at the back of this phone real quick. Is there a panel I can slide? Oh yeah, there is. There we go. All right. So here's the battery. Take that out. That is a. Uh, it's a pretty big battery for for a phone. Uh, they're normally quite small now. Let's go ahead and take... Oh, there's your... Was that the SIM card? Yeah, that was the SIM card. Okay, so there's that. Two parts left. That doohickey and whatever's on the other side of this. Uh, let's go right here. Boom. Boom. Two minutes, 54 seconds. That is good timing there. And now we are ready to blow up the phone. And I'm not sure this bomb can do damage to the phone. These things are tough. Tough phones, they don't make them like they used to. These things are also, they're just kind of bad, so. Let's go, boom! Yeah! That's pretty awesome. And let's go full speed. Oh, parts just hit me in the face. That was a quick one, huh? so yeah, there we go. Got the high score there, got the bomb, pretty awesome. But yeah, let's move on to something else. All right, so for another item that you guys wanted to see taken apart, I saw the tank on the list. We'll probably save that for another episode since that's a pretty big item. Uh, I'm kind of intrigued by the computer. I know a lot of you guys wanted to see that taken apart, see how realistic the game is. And uh, yeah, so we're going to take apart this desktop. This might actually be really cool. So in theory, this panel should just slide right off. There we go. All right, so there's your power supplies. You got your cables going down. Maybe it's a graphics card right there. Hard drives are probably back there. Is that a hard drive? I don't know. It kind of looks like a somewhat old computer. So, oh yeah, before you touch your computer, you should always unplug it. Actually, wait, did this thing actually have power? Hold on, let's reset that real quick. All right, let's uh, let's try turning this thing on. Is that a, is that something? Is that something we can do? Come on. Oh, or was it already on? Oh, hey, that turns on. Hold on, let's pull this off the side. Oh, that's so cool! You can see the fan, the CPU fan's running. Alright, got a little bit of lighting in here. There's the power supplies running. That is cool! Okay, we're gonna disassemble this. So, uh, like any good person, when you work with the PC, you know you gotta unplug the thing before you, uh, before you work on it. So, let's go there. Alright, so we got the side panel off. This panel over here shouldn't co Oh, I guess it does. Huh, okay, side panel comes off too. Uh... Oh, I guess we could have interacted with some of these parts. What are the, do the drives come out? Okay, so that's an empty drive. Is there a disk drive in here? No, that's not a... No, these are all just panels and covers. Alright, let's take all that off. Oh, it's so satisfying to see. Okay, let's go... Eh, take that panel off here. That is... No, oh, that's something. Alright, let's take that out. Can we take the button? Is that... Is that something that comes out? I don't think it is. Alright, so we got all that out. Let's go to the back of the PC here. Take that off there. Is that multiple parts? I don't believe so. Let's start unscrewing the back of this. And that should give us access to some more things to actually take out of here. So let's go there, there, there. That one goes there. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, does this just yank off? Can I just... Eh? No, it's moving the whole case. Okay, I don't want to do that quite yet. Alright, so I feel like we should start unplugging some cables here. So let's go that right there. I think that's the main power, the P1 cable. Uh, oh, come on. Come on. There we go. Okay, uh, let's go there. That is a P4. That's for the uh, the graphics cards power cable. I wonder if we can actually take the card apart. There's that. Uh, let's go... Hmm. How this little cable should come off here. This is actually really detailed. Do the RAM sticks come out? 
Oh, please tell me the ram sticks come out. Can we can we release those? It should have these little clips here. Can I can I hit the clips on the ram stick? Like the little tabs? Uh, yeah, they come out, but I don't know. Hold on, let's try this right here. Oh, here we go. Let's go here. How many sticks of ram does this have? Just two? Okay, let's go and pull those. And here comes your ram. Oh, this is too cool. Oh, this is awesome. All right. All right, so to me, the graphics card should come right out. There we go. Oh, oh graphics card's kind of stuck. Now, is the graphics card multiple pieces? Actually, what does the graphics card look like? This looks like a, a little bit of an older computer, so I probably don't... I have no clue what that's supposed to be. Uh, okay, so the fan does come out. All right, so we can take apart the graphics card. That is... Uh, that's a thing. So, how? Is there screws? Oh, it looks like there's something right there. Let's flip this over. There we go. All right, graphics card is flipped. Can we just yank on this panel to pull it off? Is there screws? Kinda looks like there's screw holes there, but I'm not really sure. All right, so that comes off on the graphics card. Was that what was holding this together? You would think there's some screws around here somewheres, but I can't quite make out where those screws are. This thing is in two pieces, I know that. Let's look at the top of the card again. Huh. This is a bit of a tricky one here. Yeah, there's stuff to rip out in it, man. This is actually a tough one, because I'm not really seeing... Like, there's these little screws... Oh, those are... Okay, I was looking at that, I was like... I couldn't click them at first, they're really hard to hit. There we go. Uh, so we're gonna unscrew this panel here, and this should split open the graphics card, in theory. No? Come on. Come on! Smash it against the wall! Uh, am I missing a screw here? Okay. There must be more screws around here. Come on. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, the top panel just came off. Now the fan, I believe, you can be removed. So let's go. Uh, come on. Come on. Okay, I saw you move. Come on. Pull out. Dang it. This card is being a pain in my rear end. I think this... Why would it go out that way? All right, well, that's the thing. Um, so, fan. Is the fan another item that should be able to be pulled out? I believe so. No, it actually looks like we're selecting the whole thing now. I, I don't think the fan actually... Maybe the fan doesn't pop out. No, yeah, it does. Okay, so there's the fan. Alright, so that seems like a, a hollow piece. Is this... That looks like a huge heat sink. Does that come off? Okay, that doesn't come off. Okay, let's move on to this section. Any of these little pieces come off? This looks like a whole piece, too. So I think the graphics card is disassembled. Uh, I believe. Yeah. Alright, so let's move on to the next thing here. Eventually, I'd like to get the motherboard out. Let's go ahead, uh, this is a power cable. Can I get this out of here? Come on, power cable. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, well, I guess not. All right, so there's some screws I noticed on the bottom of the power supply. Actually, the power supply should be screwed in back here. I almost feel like the power supply is loose. Wouldn't it be loose? I think it's loose right now. No. Oh, yeah, it is loose. Uh, or... Okay, well, maybe it's partially loose. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? Come on, power supply. All right, yeah, it is loose. Okay, so we can unscrew this thing, too. And uh, it looks like it's still holding some power. This is definitely dangerous. I do not suggest doing this <laughs> at home with the power supply. Never unscrew these things. Uh, just uh, go get a new one. Or have this one replaced if it's got a warranty. All right, so I don't know what the inside of a power supply looks like, but I'm, uh, I'm a bit intrigued to figure out what it is. Let's go all those screws. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Hit this one here. There we go. All right. Oh. 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 All right, so is the fan... Okay, the fan is still somehow in there. So let's flip this over. Uh, let's see. How's the fan... Okay, there we go. Fan's disconnected. Is there a, an inner part? Yep, there's an inner part. Okay, so fan is disconnected. We're down to 55 parts. Uh, okay, so there's like a little board in here or something. Hmm, how do I get the board out? Oh, that comes out. Whatever that is. Oh, this doohickey. Oh, is this the power button? Oh, that's the power button. Okay, that comes out. There's that. All right, good. Good, good, good. All right, power cables. Can we slide the board out yet? No, we can't. Ah, oh, Four screws on this. All right, so let's uh, disassemble these screws here, here, and uh, these two here. There we go. And boom. All right, board slides out. What about these, like, uh, I think those are capacitors. Could, uh, does any of this come out? 
All right, and I, just fling that over there. We're good. All right, let's go to the uh, rest here. We're getting, we're getting there. This is happening. Okay, so we gotta figure out how to get this hard drive out. Let's go ahead and let's continue with the fan and stuff like that. Okay, so let's get the fan. Pretty sure that's two pieces there. Let's go fan. That piece, all right, there should be a power connector. Maybe we already got that. Let's take these uh, clips. I think we need to take these off. This should release the heat sink. Let's go there, there, there. All right, here comes the heat sink. Cool, that's off. Uh, can more of these pieces be removed? Oh, they can, yeah. I'm glad I spotted these. Come on, come on. Nope, 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 nope. The game's gotta decide if it wants to let me release these. I'm pretty sure these need to come off, so come on, game. Let's uh, let's do this. Let me have these pieces. I need to finish this. I want to bomb the computer, dang it. All right, so we're moving more stuff on the uh, motherboard here. I'm still going to work with that heat sink. It seems like it's giving me a little bit of issues. We're about to remove probably the CPU here. Can this? This cable is really inconvenient and in my way, so there we go. Uh, no, come on. Come on, there we go, finally. All right, so that's out of the way. Good, uh, let's remove that. I don't know really what that is. Is that the, like the onboard? Is it integrated graphics card or? I don't know, I'm kind of lost on my parts here. Let's get the CPU out. There should be like a little clip. Probably right here at the top. Come on, uh, actually the pin's over here. Okay, eh, release. Okay, okay, here comes the, uh, oh, it's too cool. Okay, here comes the CPU. Oh, it's Intel. Okay, it's a, is that an i7? I believe it said an i7 on there. Hold on. Let's read that. Uh, it's kind of really pixelated and blurry. Yeah, I believe it is an i7. I don't think... Yeah, don't handle your uh, CPUs like this, but yeah, we'll just set that over to the side. Okay, so that popped off. Does that mean this pops off? Oh yeah, that pops off. Alright, so we have like the little base. Is that a thing? Okay, that's not a thing. Okay, so we're down to 35 parts here. I think it's time to start unscrewing. This is probably going to be at least six or seven parts here. All these screws that got to come out of the motherboard. So you got those. There should be like a mid screw somewhere. Uh, here we go. There's one there. One there. And one here. Oh yeah, the parts are counting down. We are going to take apart this computer. This is so awesome. I really, really like this. I don't know why it's still got power to it, but yeah. Uh, let's get the LEDs unplugged. Okay, those are already unplugged, I think. Cool, so we got all those. I believe that is it as far as screws. Yeah, this is ready to come out. So let's remove the motherboard here. Oh, we just went through the wall. Nope, we're still on the wall. Cool. Okay, so we removed the motherboard. So let's go ahead and slide that over here. Cool, all right, so. Oh, so that's the thing. All right, so front panel's off. Uh, I'm pretty sure that removes there. There's the power button. Does the uh, little bitty portion? Yep, that little bitty top part comes off the power button. Uh, we're doing this. Um, what about this bottom? No, uh, that's the whole case. I'm struggling to see where the screws at are right around the uh, the hard drive here. Ah, here we. Nope. So look at that. That screw's just a. Uh, it's just on there. It's not actually a screw we can work with. Hmm. There's a screw somewhere that I'm missing here. And I need to find it. Let's see. Can I remove this? Oh, I think I can remove the hard drive bay here. So let's go. Boom. Slide you out. All right. Is the hard drive. Can I get it out? All right. It says I can't, but I just obviously did. Uh, that's kind of weird. Throw that against the wall. Uh, anything I can remove on the hard drive? Can we remove? Oh, we can unscrew the hard drive itself. All right. That's good to know. Uh, maybe that's why we we're getting the red there. So one terabyte hard drive. Solid states are uh, kind of expensive. Let's pull this open here. Come on. Come on. Come on, panel. Oh, is that another screw? No. Come on, panel. Come on. Come on. Just shake the hard drive. All right, Mr. Hard Drive. I'm going to flip you over this way. Maybe the top comes off. Is that a thing? Oh, it does. Of course it comes off. All right. Let's remove the chip. All right. Yeah, that's removed. Can we remove this little end piece? No. Okay. So we're down to seven parts here. I think most of it is the case. Now, question is... Oh, here we go. Okay, that... Oh, oh, case is freaking out a little bit. Piece there, piece there. That top piece there. Oh, uh oh, 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 come on, case. All right, we're down to four pieces, and I think I know which four pieces they are. Yeah. Or, no, maybe I don't know which four pieces they are. Oh, that pops off. There's four pieces on this heat sink that I couldn't get off, and 
I was thinking it was maybe those. This should come off. Come on. There we go. Two pieces. Two whole pieces. What are... Oh, we've got a mess here. Oh. Oh. There's a piece. All right. One piece left. Is there any more pieces on this? So the hard drive or the case's top comes off. All right. Fling that over there. I feel like there's something... I feel like this back panel is a piece. Is there a screw that I can hit here? Oh, I feel so stupid. I know what it is. It's going to be the motherboard bat battery. Yep. Dang it. <laughs> All right. It is time to blow this computer up. Let's reset the computer. All right. So say you're playing your favorite game and uh, your computer starts to act up. You know what? You're just tired of it. You don't want to deal with your computer anymore. So you kind of take the panel off here. Let's go ahead and grab the bomb. Oh, okay. So... Yeah, this always makes your, uh, this is a sure way to make your PC run fast again. You just grab a bomb. Uh, let's try to, come on. There you go. All right, so yeah, just, just stick a bomb in your PC. Let's go ahead and, can we somewhat, can we get this panel back on? Ah, oh, the panel's bent. You know what? It, it's okay. Ah, oh, that, that's perfect. The panel is close enough. Man, these panels bend really easy. This is a cheap case. All right, there we go. All right, folks, so let's go ahead and power on the PC. Uh, there we go. PC is powered on. Beautiful. All right, let's explode. Boom! <laughs> Instantly down to zero parts. Oh, that is so awesome. Yes! Ah, uh, the destruction of the PC. All right, let's go speed that up. Oh, yeah, it's raining parts. We have annihilated that PC. Hey, look, new record. But yeah, that's probably going to about wrap it up for this episode of Disassembly 3D. If you enjoyed this episode, maybe hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more of this, let me know down in the comments below what items you want to see next. But anyways, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. More of this will be coming up in the future. We've got some more brick rigs on the way. We've got some more Gmod, Scrap Mechanic, and we have some more Beam and G coming up very soon. So... Yeah, I hope you guys have a great day, and we will see you guys next time. Thank you.